Mike Phillips down here at Auto Geek Show Car Garage and tonight our Auto Geeks Car of the Week is actually a 1954 Ford F100. Now these are called fat fendered Fords because the front fenders and even the rear fenders are huge on this thing. In fact these have custom fenders and they're actually wider than stock. Now a lot of people they looked at this car when I posted the pictures on the forum and thought hey the paint looks really good on there how can you improve that at all? Well in the pictures it looks pretty good but what you can't see is what our eyes can see and as I walk around here to the other side and get the sun overhead positioned just right, you're going to see what we call holograms or rotary buffer induced swirls. And it completely distracts from the beauty of the paint job and the body lines of this truck. So chances are, after talking to the owner, this thing was painted, sanded, cut and buffed, and their last machine polishing process was with the rotary buffer and because of the hash marks in the paint, it actually kind of looks like they finished out with just a wool finishing pad. Not a cutting pad, but a finishing pad, which is, of course, softer. But each one of the fibers of the wool pad still put a cut in the paint. And that's what leaves these hologram or these buffer trails that are just so ugly on a show car or a show truck like this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump up here on some scaffolding and I'll show you the roof. The roof is actually the same way. So it's completely filled with rotary buffer swirls. And I inspected the sides of the truck, so the bed, the fenders, and the sides of the doors, and they're the same way. It's just harder to capture the swirls on those vertical panels, you know, when the sun is overhead. Pretty much all you can get are the uh, horizontal panels. So we're going to have to rebuff every square inch of this paint to remove the swirls and restore a show car finish. And we're going to do that starting at 5 o'clock in our Auto Geeks What's in the Garage TV studio here. Anyway, it is a very beautiful truck. And it's a lot of fun to drive. There's a low car shifter, one of my favorites. But again, it just has all these ugly swirls in it. And so what we're going to do is we're going to remove the swirls. Then we're going to apply a finishing wax. And when we're done, this paint will look like it just came out of the paint booth. It'll look dripping wet. And then when we're done, we'll put all the pictures up on autogeekonline.net. That's our discussion forum. So check it out.